You know, I'm all about getting a hot deal on a Honda Accord. I'm all about getting a hot deal on any car that I'm talking about on this channel. However, I just think that it is perfectly feasible to get a smoking hot deal on a Honda Accord. And in this video, what I wanna do for you is give you a sense for what to be targeting on a brand new Honda Accord if you're planning on purchasing or leasing some average maintenance and repair costs as well as the average insurance premium. That way you get the whole picture as far as what this Honda Accord is gonna cost you. What is happening guys? Ari here from Boston Automotive Consulting and in the description below, you're gonna find various resources to shop around for not only the very best Honda Accord deal, but you'll be able to check out insurance rates get your auto credit scores, as well as shop for an auto loan. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing because this whole channel is gonna teach you everything you're gonna to need to know so that you can negotiate your best possible deal. Very, very sad that the Honda Accord EX is no longer with us. However, I did see that a lot of the Honda Accords that we've got in inventory in the United States, a lot of them are sport SEs, which really do have a ton of equipment. Now, as far as the inventory that's available in the United States, at the moment, we've got nearly 23,000 Honda Accords, 22,285 to be exact, as 2021s, and we've still got roughly 1,805 leftover 2020s according to car gurus. Now of this 22,285, what we've got is, is 5,665 LXs, 7,050 sports, 5,480 sport SEs, 2,225 EXLs, 1,860 Touring. Don't ask me about 2.0 Ts. I don't wanna talk about that right now. Now, because we've got so, so many sports, I've got one picked out for this negotiation guide tonight with an MSRP of 28,580. At a very minimum, target 6% off of the MSRP. This is what I think any dealership without too, too much trouble will give you off of the MSRP, off of a Honda Accord. I can comfortably tell you anywhere between nine and 10% here in Massachusetts. No problem. However, just going after 6% off of the MSRP gets us to a target selling price of 26,865. Unfortunately, no rebate coming from Honda. However, we do have a promotional APR at 1.9% at 60 months, 2.9% at 72. Going after 6% off of the MSRP gets you, again, 26,865. If you wanna go after more, definitely wanna encourage you to do that. And financing this, at 60 months at 1.9% and putting just your taxes and fees up front gets you to a payment of 479 per month. Now, if you're planning on leasing the Honda Accord Sport, same 26,865 as before, <laughs> really $200 in lease cash coming from Honda, a residual super high, 61% for 36 months at 12,000 miles a year with a money factor super low, 0 0.00066. Now, plugging it all in into the lease calculator and assuming that you're giving just your inception fees due at start, so your first payment, acquisition fee, dock fee, registration, all that stuff due up front, roughly about 1635 bucks. Lease payment's not too, too bad. We'd be talking about $303 a month. That's including sales tax, you guys. Again, that's at 6% off. You can manage to get like a thousand below invoice. You're in the high twos. Now, as far as some average maintenance and repair costs, you guys, this is where the Honda Accord really shines. After the initial warranty period runs up, expect your average maintenance cost to be around $415 and your average repair cost to be around $295, and your insurance costs, not bad at all either. We'd be talking about $1,080 in Arizona, $1,475 in California, $1,625 in Florida, $965 Illinois, $1,040 Massachusetts, 
2255 Michigan, 1365 New York, 745 North Carolina, 1240 Pennsylvania, 1565 Texas, 775 in Virginia. Want to encourage you guys to use the links in the description below to shop around for the very best deal on a Honda Accord. You'll also be able to check out insurance rates, get your auto credit scores, as well as shop for an auto loan. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. Thank you so, so much for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.